Hello and welcome to the first episode of the series that puts a little twist on the usual Monster Spotlight format. This time we'll be looking at the units that made a name for themselves outside the world arena, the PvE Titans. And the fresh new series is going to start with the monsters that are freshest on the scene, the twins. Specifically, Shina and Sabrina. We'll start with Shina. She's fire in more ways than one, and I actually don't have one. So this is kind of like writing escapist fiction for me. Her leader skill is a 24% speed lead in the arena. Her first skill attacks twice and does extra damage if the target is at a low HP. Her second skill is an AoE with a 30% chance to stun on each of its two hits. But what really makes her incredible is her passive, Precision. Shina applies one turn of defense break with every attack and decreases her victim's attack bars by 15% if they have debuff supply. The latter part of that will also be applied to whichever boomerang warrior you have attacking with her. And speaking of boomerang warriors, Sabrina is the water boomerang warrior and a common pairing for Shina. Where Shina had an arena lead skill, Sabrina's is geared towards guild battles. It yields a 40% accuracy boost to your team, which is actually pretty sweet because her first skill applies defense break on a 50% chance, and if she's attacking with Shina, a little extra accuracy is always welcome. Her second skill is called Triple Strike. The name is a bit on the nose, but in application it's pretty incredible. Each of the three hits will have a 50% chance to apply attack break, defense break, and heal block. And finally, her passive Female Warrior reduces damage received from enemies with beneficial effects by 35%, and she'll deal 35% more damage to enemies without beneficial effects. And if you have a Chakram Dancer on your team, the effect will be applied to them too. The twins really shine in the dungeons. Necro has never been so accessible. At the very least, they'll be taking three hits off the boss's shield each turn as long as they attack together, and the attack bar reduction is wonderful in GB10 and DB10. Defense break is great everywhere. As far as runes go, the twins work really well on Violent because one additional turn means a crazy amount of damage is about to happen. And for Sabrina, I went with Violent Focus to make sure I land my debuffs. Since I don't have a Shina of my own, here are Daniel Karaoke's runes for his Shina. Also, thank you to Daniel Karaoke for giving us permission to show off your rep monster's runes. Speed crit damage attack is a crowd favorite build, but there's no shame in going attack crit damage attack if you can find the speed in the substats, and don't forget the crit rate. But how did you ruin yours? Better question, what were you able to accomplish with your twins? Let me know in a comment down below and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye bye